Hello there, YouTube. My name is Wendy, after police. Call me Wendy, and welcome back to The Sims 4. We're back. Oh my goodness gracious! Don't mind me adjusting my mic. Uh, I was trying to figure out the best place to put my mic, so not only could you guys see me, but you could hear me okay, and hopefully there won't be any major static problems or whatever uh, and whatnot. But if there is, I do apologize for that. Anyway, um, I'm trying to think of any of Yeah, I've most like I said uh, in the previous video where I explained the whole bug in the ear situation. Uh, I just took some time off to let my ear be and get some healing in and whatnot. Um, but, uh, yeah, we're just, I, my ear feels okay. I don't, I, okay. So for the most part, I had ear drops and everything, but for the most part, outside of my hearing readjusting after a couple days and all that stuff, I do feel like I can hear okay, which is good. Um, and for a little bit, I had some extra dizziness from both the ear drops and I think just everything being infected which I was told that that was going to be normal and that was going to happen. But otherwise, I'm okay. I'm not as off balance anymore, but, uh, yeah. Anyway, we're going to jump right back in to the Glam Rocks. Uh, if I seem a little sporadic, I am so sorry. It is just because I am still trying to kind of get back into the swing of the thing and everything, but, yeah. I also changed up, as you can see, the entire house. Why? Because we needed to. So, I will show that off first. But, um, yeah, if you guys aren't usually watching much, like, if you're new to the channel first, hi, welcome. Uh, you know, and then if you aren't just up to date on what happened, uh, in my previous video, I, not a Sims video, just a previous in general video, I talked about how I had gotten a bug in my ear and it was absolutely horrifying. I hated every second of it. Um, but I was mentioned that I was going to take a few days to, um, let my ear be as well as probably a few little bit extra of time just to get stuff back to normal and everything but um yeah we're back now <laughs> i gotta turn the sound a little bit that's actually kind of loud <laughs> well probably because it's like right here in this ear Yeah, but yeah, it feels really good to be back and recording, and I really can't wait to show you guys uh, how everything is. So, and I mean, I changed pretty much everything. Anything that I didn't end up reusing, I just took out. Oh yeah, I had to take everybody out so um, I could uh, build the house and everything, and we'll fix that in a minute. But let's start with the outside a little bit. Okay, I will say that a lot of this is kind of similar to. Um, Monty and Annalena's house in the other game, but that was just because the way it was working worked really well for what we needed. So anyway, we kind of followed that, but here's some plants. Oh, I forgot the outdoor lights right here. I can do that off camera. Okay. Then there's out here. I thought I, wait, I thought I did put out light door lights. Ah, well, we'll I'll, you know what? I'll do those off camera. No biggie. But anyway, see you. Okay, so this is the main entryway. It's very, very large and open and whatnot. Uh, I have to adjust the lights to be um, auto lights and whatnot. Uh, and here is the kitchen. And when a bit more spruced up and fancy and whatnot. Uh, and a bit more room and whatnot. We still have the little bar area. We still have the table and whatnot. Uh, then coming over here is the living room. All read on up. We have usual exercise equipment. Uh, a little bit set up so they have stuff to play with and everything. Uh, got the little stuff up here. Over here is the bathroom for downstairs. Uh, more done up. I know there's a lot of browns and such, but it was kind of hard to get, like, decent wall colors that I wanted to make it match everything. So kind of had to do, like, brown and branch off and everything. Not always, but sometimes. Go upstairs. Go up. The one that I did change around is whose bedroom was where. Uh, so, for example, over here... We have Monty and Chica's room. I actually changed up, uh, put them on the second floor. Because a lot of times whenever I like, try to click for Monty and Chica, I'd go to second floor. And then I would go to, like, for the, third, the third floor for Freddy and Roxy. And I was kind of like, okay, let's just do this. But I think this turned out really, really good. And everything. Then here's the bathroom. The shared bathroom. Updated and whatnot. With two seats for potty training. Uh, and whatnot. Then this will open. I was going to make a playroom, like, right here, but I kind of wasn't sure and whatnot. Then over here is Dorian's room. His cute little bedroom. Yeah, let me turn, uh, these lights. There we go. But this is his bedroom now. And everything. I think it looks a lot better. 
and whatnot. Then we get him up, and here is Monty, or not Monty, Freddy and Foxy's, Foxy, listen to me. I can't pronounce words today. Freddy and Roxy's room. And I like how this was. And then here is the bathroom. And one that's kind of small, but it works and everything. Uh, I also put in a little seat for, um, um, Aria. And then over here, we actually have Aria's bedroom. It's done up a little differently. I also, as you can see, I also took out the high chairs of the little tots rooms. And that's just because of all the chaos we were having with some of the high chairs and earbuds. And then, of course, the roof. Yeah, and then for outside, you see, we have another pirate ship. We have the garden things and yada, yada, yada. Okay. So. Uh, no, don't do that. <laughs> Auto lights. All lights. Just be sure we're going to make sure we lock all of the proper doors. Lock for everyone but the household members. Lock for... Everyone but household members. Lock for everyone but household members. And I'm just doing this as like a weird safety thing, as weird as that sounds. Because I'm one, that, like, I know that, like, technically in the game, the only things that can really come into the house are, like, vampires or whatever. But still, it makes me feel better to, um, just make sure everything is secure. You know what I mean? I think it's because, like, we all, like, you know, we sure our houses are all locked up and everything. And then the gate's right there. Allow. I guess, hold on. So, unlock. Lock for everyone but household members. Okay, I think we're good. Okay. Now that he was very super tired. So, oh, I'm gonna have to make him get up all the way up here. <laughs> oh, no. Poor bud. Exhausted. Okay. Okay, so we have time to get him to bed. Good. His hunger will be fine for now. So the first thing we're going to do... Oh! Something else I'm also going to do, and I'm going to just let you guys see this. You know the little wind things they have right there? I'm going to turn those off. Mm, excuse me. My allergies are draining. I'm so sorry about that. Because here's the thing. Is that it was when I was playing um, one of my own personal games or whatever. That these wind things... Or no... I think you no okay no it was with Annalene and Monty and I was trying to get the friendship friendship stuff up with um the triplets, and because I wasn't doing like feel like doing the things they wanted to do like oh a fear of unaccomplished desires or something and I was like, what? So basically, from my understanding, is that they're no longer the little whim things that you can like decide if you do or don't want to do something. Basically, you have to do them, and if you don't, you can get a fear of unaccomplished, like, stuff. I don't know why I keep hitting this. I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> there's also, like, other fears, like, fear of drowning and whatnot, which is kind of neat. I like, I like that they added that. But at the same time, they just took away whims and made it something entirely wa entirely wasn't. And I thought, like, I don't want to have to deal with this and whatnot because this is annoying. So we're just going to do something different. Oh, yeah, they're baby. You know, baby. Hold on, I want to show the baby. Baby's here. She's right here. How's this baby? How's Viola? Okay, as far as we can tell, she's okay. So then once that happens, once she's done, we're gonna let her go to sleep. Okay, so daddy's got it. Daddy's got it for now. Okay. He's fine. Okay, we're doing good. Okay, sit there for just a minute, bud. Can we do battle self? Um, there's no babble to self. Okay. What the? No, don't switch his chairs around. Here, I got a bug. You don't need to switch him. Doesn't say like it's. Oh, it's Dorian's. In. There we go. Hey, really? Let's do you'll be okay. And then pick him up. But yeah, the entire time I've not seen any type of apologize thing. Put Dorian down here. Here, bud. Okay, and then he's... No! Do not... 
No. Why did he pull him out? You need to eat, bud. You're hungry. Pick him up. Put Dorian down here. No. Eat the yogurt. Oh my god. Put Dorian down here. He's hungry. What the fuck? Okay, put him in the thing. What in the world is going on? How you doing, Jake? Are you getting food? I'll take care of that for you. Sure. Okay. Why isn't it letting him put... <sighs> okay. Pick him up. I'm trying to give you food, but no, you're not calling for her. Is this because he's just trying to give you food? What is up with this? Put him there. We're trying to get you to eat, but this is your high chair now. Eat it. Yes, eat it, eat it, eat it. Finally. Just sit in Freddy's chair, it's fine, he won't care. So. What does Dorian need, anyway? Not too much. Can take care of more of his needs in the morning, because some of them are just only a little low. Okay, so Dorian can do kind of his own thing for a little bit. Oh good, he's feeling playful. His skills are all maxed out, aren't they? Except for thinking. Okay, that works, we can do work on his thinking. Okay. So you can do study shapes. And then he now gets to take care of himself. <coughs> Excuse me. So go to the bathroom. Get some sleep. Okay. Much better. Now we've got things more under control. Okay. So now... He can use the bathroom. And then in the morning when they wake up, I'll probably send someone to um, Henford and Begley just to uh, get some new stuff because of all the new potting plants we have and all those other stuff I don't have. Or, well, technically you can actually order some from a computer. Um, oh, no, hold on. Okay. Who's got high levels of gardening? I gotta, like, double check. Six... Seven, eight, five. She's got the highest. Because you have to be like a certain level in order to order certain uh, seed packets. Um, we'll do these. Ah, I'm coming. Get a bunch of these. And go. Okay. Okay, so he is going to sleep. He's doing better. Oh, yeah, mommy can get it. Mommy can get him. Mommy can get a. Okay, yeah, daddy, you no, daddy, you go back to sleep. You go back to sleep. Daddy's mama's got it. You go back to sleep, daddy. Mama's got it. Okay. So I will probably come back. Either when they're going to Henford on Begley, or whenever they're doing something in our week. Okay, so I was basically just, um, just trying to wait out the night and do whatever I need to and get their little friendship up, because soon it's going to be Viola's birthday. But she could just hit level 10 of the parenting skill, goodness. 
So I'm trying to think. So she's got 10 of the cooking, but 10 of the parenting? Or it hasn't even shown it yet. There we go. Now it is. Woo! Okay. Mm, excuse me. So let's see who's got ten, who's got level tens. Um, he's got ten in parenting. Okay. He does not have any tens, but he's close to ten in parenting. She's got ten in cooking, a ten in parenting, and no tens. And of course, we're just been working on his thinking. Yeah. How long did the tots have? You've got 23 days, you've got 25, you're good. You two are good. Okay. So now we're sending mama back to sleep. Yeah, but yeah, I wanted to um, show you guys and whatnot. Yeah, he was trying to go upstairs to play with the dollhouse up there. <laughs> what the? Why is there? Hold on. Please pardon me while I get rid of this. I have no idea why this mailbox is here. Because I thought I'd get rid of it. Because there should be a mailbox out here, isn't there? Where the... Okay. Weird. Hold on. Um... Please pardon me as I fix the thing. Uh, I will just come back, um... Whenever... Okay, I will be back when either something happens, or something else happens... Or whatever may be the case. Okay, so Roxanne is awake and uh, we're having her go bathroom and whatnot. Uh, just since she basically needs stuff and everything. But uh, yeah, we're letting her go ahead and get up. Uh, it's currently 4.38 in the game and that's fine. Alrighty. But yeah, if I'm also I think I'm talking a little faster than normal and I'm really sorry about that. I think I'm just happy and excited to finally be back and be playing and stuff, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah. I don't know what <laughs> Okay, how are the tots? Dorian is okay, minus hunger and hygiene. So he'll definitely have to get a bath when he gets up and everything. She definitely needs some fun. But soon- what is this? Oh, the yeah, I get that. Okay, but she'll need- well- yeah, we can let her sleep for a bit longer. She'll be okay in terms of, like, food and whatnot. She's okay for a minute. But soon, definitely, we need to, um... Um... Get her up. If not, she's fine. Okay. So these two are just fine. He's hungry, but he'll probably be up soon. What are you doing? No! No! That's not your damn sink! Okay, like, okay, before I played, there was an update to the game, and apparently the developers did not fix this issue, so I'm gonna say it out again, just so maybe it can be heard vocally. The people who made the Sims 4 game, developers, etc., fix that. Because that makes no sense. Why would you go, like, if her, the other sink was, like, in use, I understand it, but she does not need to go to an entirely different bathroom and wash her hands there. She could have washed them in her room. Monty did it. I don't know what is up with that. Yeah, he he'll probably be up soon. He'll probably be the next one up, Freddy. Uh, she's still asleep. They're fine for now. Oh, I was right. It was Freddy. Okay, we'll get you food, bud. Here first. Come use the bathroom. And just so it registers that he needs to wash his hands in his bathroom, you can wash your hands there. Like, I like the fact that it automatically has them wash your hands, which is good. But at the same time, I hate the fact that it won't, like, keep them, like, have them do it at their place. Or their bathroom. Because that makes no sense. Okay. And then serve breakfast. Pancakes. Oh. Baby's up. Okay. Who has the more... You do. Technically. Well, food is... Food is good. Okay, food is going to take a minute for it to make. So... Diaper. Then you can also pay the baby. Because baby needs attention. You... Can... Come and use the bathroom. And then come downstairs. You... 
can come here when you're done. Okay, so daddy's got the baby. Daddy's got the baby. Dorian is okay. Aria's okay. Also, part of me like scratching at my toe my teeth. I, it's a weird thing I do. Okay. Yeah, baby's okay. Super efficient baby care. <laughs> Don't need to do that right now. Yeah, spend time with your baby. She's making breakfast. Mmm, excuse me. Yeah, I've been trying to get their- I also want to get their handies up so we can like make sure that this doesn't catch fire or anything again. Why is he angry? Just hot headed? Yeah, he's fine. You're getting food- what are you doing, Chica? No! <sighs> I don't know why. That, that annoys me to no end. I have no idea of how else to explain it. Okay. Yeah, you're coming here. Grab my Foxy. Okay, we should be done in a minute. Okay. Grab a serving. Grab a serving. You're eating. Then we're gonna have him play with the baby a little bit. Now Roxy needs some s things. Here, water those for me. Socials. We do that? Okay. She can buy plants and then you can also talk to them. Just to get some socialization up. So this is ask for food. What's this part? I, okay, I guess he was gonna do it anyway. Okay. So then we're gonna let Okay, so she can do that, touch the plan. Then she can come up and do Aria, because not only does she need the socialization, but we can have them work on their little relationship because last time it was a little, not very good. Okay. How's it going in here, Daddy? Pretty good it seems. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, he's okay. Mm, excuse me. Okay, so she's getting him food. He's just angry because he's hungry. She's going up to her room. Okay. For the minute, since like they're right here, I'm just trying to get like his relationship stuff up with the baby. Okay, then he's doing that. I think once we have um some of the tots like or well, not really all the some not okay. Once we have stuff kind of chill and whatnot, I think I actually may have to wrap up this video. So I don't think we'll get to visit Hemford and Begley in this episode, which kind of sucks. But at the same time, that's just how it is. Doesn't he have the handiness levels? Yeah, he's got the handiness. Can he upgrade this? Oh, yeah! Sweet! Okay, so he's doing that. He's with the baby. He's so sparkly. Okay. He's doing that. No. Come back here. Get. Let him out of there. Uh, praise. And then let him out. Okay, she's up here with her. Okay, it's good that it worked. Okay, that worked out well. You. What does she need? Ooh, bathroom. Okay, so. Alright, can go potty. Rocks in. Um. Just sit. For a minute. Okay. Okay, so Freddy's doing that. Chica's being mommy. Mm, excuse me. Okay. 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 Ok
Loveborn. Yeah, I know. You're Lovelorn. We'll fix that soon. I promise. How is the relationship between those two going? Pretty good. Okay. So since their thing is now almost full, I am going to have him come down and get food. Hey. Grab a serving. And Roxanne, you stay here. Okay. <laughs> Proud of potty. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Anyway. Now then. She also needs food and some fun. So let's do food first. Um, Pick her up. But yeah, we need to work on their relationship. Okay, how are you? Yeah, it's pretty much full for him. You're doing that. And then after he's done with that, he can do a self-cleaning upgrade. Then, what are you doing? I don't know. What is this? Don't know why this isn't full. Oh, that's right. Because we switched her thing. That's right. <laughs> why are you angry? Of course he had sugar. Tell a knock knock That's fine. What are his needs? He needs a potty. So... No, don't put him down. Okay, you tell a quick knock knock joke. No. Okay. Uh, mommy. I want you to pick him up. Because this will just be faster. Pick him up. Okay. Put Dorian down here. Okay. And then Dorian can use the potty. And then it works because then we can also just do a bath. So, now Dorian, go potty. Stay here. Okay, they're going for food. Okay. I think things are going pretty good. Okay. Um, but looking at everything, I do think I have to start wrapping it up here. So thank you guys again so very much for watching. It feels really, really good to, uh, get back into the swing of things. I know this video isn't the most exciting, but it's mostly just us taking care of everything going on, uh, and whatnot. So I guess this is kind of just a more of getting back into the swing of it. Next episode, we're going to go, I keep hitting, I don't know why I keep hitting the microphone. I'm so sorry. The next episode, we're not only going to go for going to Headburn on um, Begley and getting some other stuff and whatnot uh we will be trying to uh work on aria skills the thinking skill for dorian as well as his responsibility aspect uh and whatnot but yeah that's kind of my plan and whatnot if it doesn't go that way that's okay but yeah anywho thank you guys again so very much for watching i hope you all thoroughly enjoyed and i will see you all in the next video Mwah! bye